Welcome to part two. Yep, welcome back to the show. This is Dr. Fox, my video jukebox hotline number 09. I know 100 3 to 1. I'm glad I got it right this time. Now, the question before we went away for the break, Luce was... Irene Cara went to number one with the hit song Fame. Who else had a hit song with the song with the same title? David, where are you from? Hello, Foxy. Hi, how are you? I'm OK, you? Good, yeah. You having a good Friday night? Yeah, I've just finished work, actually. Yeah, not bad, not bad. Well, what time did you finish work? Um, about 11. Blimey, what do you do? Well, it's just a part-time job. It's, um, I work for a company called Turner's in Guildford. OK. Right, the answer then, please. What's uh, the... Go on. David Bowie. David Bowie, absolute correct, which means you get the entire VIP trip out on, on for you and three of your friends, oh, which is brilliant. You get the limo, you get the jerk in the murk, Excellent. and uh, you get uh, off to, you know, Planet Hollywood. You go off to see fame. Have a wonderful time, OK? Oh, great. Thanks, Foxy. Take care. Thanks for calling. Brilliant. All right, then. Uh, let's take another call. 0990 100 321 is the hotline. Uh, let's go to Valletta. Hey, Foxy. Valletta. Well, that's a strange, exotic name, if I may say. Thanks very much. Good. Yours. Um, hey, what can we play for you? Can, can you play me Jazzy Jeff and the Fresh Prince? Summertime. Oh. Well, it's a bit out of date. I don't mind saying that, but... I uh, know. Yeah, I miss the summer. I hate the winter. Yeah, don't we all? What do you do? Um, me? Well, I'm a student at the moment. OK. How old? I'm 19. Um, and why this video? Well, I suppose I, I love the summertime. I'm very really yeah. depressed this time of year. And uh, it reminds me of getting my bum burned on Brighton Beach. Getting your bum burned? Yeah, it was one, you know, it was one of those cloudy days and it doesn't yeah. look like you're going to get burned. And, yeah, and I did. And I couldn't sit down on the train on the way home. Did any nice man rub some cream in, you know, sort of, of a, a doctor when you got home or anything like that? Hey, steady on. <laughs> well, look, we're going to be running this one, OK? Let's get on to this. This is Jazzy Jeff. And it's summertime, and this brings back some wonderful memories. I need a comedy bank number, please. Anything between 1 and 100, but not uh, 42. What do you fancy, Valletta? I'm oh. sorry? What number? Oh, Val number we need a comedy bank number, please. Number 19. 19 is on after Jazzy Jeff on Dr. Fox's video jukebox. So here it is. Here it is. Do you actually know Oscar Wilde? Not personally, no. But I do know someone who could get his fax number for you. Oh. Shall we dance? Of course, the uh, new Hugh Grant movie is out at the moment called Nine Months Now. He's bald, beautiful and sexy, but enough about Harry Hill. Richard Fairbrass <laughs> is here. He's an exclusive oh, on the new so video, sweet. and we will talk in just a minute. On the video jukebox. <laughs> Harry Hill. Do you want to know something rather funny? Actually, uh, Richard just told me that last week, you phoned up, didn't you? I did, actually, You phoned yeah. up, and? I was very drunk. And what I had did you a, request? I requested Dippy Dippy as the most fantastic video ever ever made, actually, and by I, human hand. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I hope it's an offend you, but we didn't what actually play we... it last week. I don't know if you noticed that. You didn't play it last week, No, we didn't, no, we didn't. Oh, no, Sorry <laughs> about that, no. Sorry, no, you're damn right, we didn't. I didn't give my number, you see. Now, this is, actually, this is the exclusive, and we'll talk about this in a minute. It wasn't your nipple, was it? We no, that was, was Fred's. Fred's. That was Fred's, Because yeah. you're pierced, aren't you? Yes. Yes, I wanted to get that yeah, right. Yeah, that one. And uh, I... can we just... No, don't no, do the no, socks. No, I'm on. not going to do the socks. No. Show the socks. No, because people will be... My stylist will be furious with me right, if I do that. He's got white I've got socks white on socks. tonight, <laughs> but they're not Terry Towling, so I thought I should. Now, I'm now, a big Badledon fan, You've got your own record label now, and you've got a new video we're seeing the exclusive of, and things have changed. You've had a hard couple of years, haven't you? Hang on, let me just rephrase that. No, no, no. For you, I like it? the way you're breaking it to me easy like that, yeah. you know what I mean? Yeah, it's been um, tough. It's, we've had a rough, a roughish. Not as bad as it's been in Bosnia, but it's been a bit rough. Yeah, yeah sure. Yeah. Yeah. But now, now everything's sort of happy and uh, everything's wonderful. Yeah, we've started our own record label. We've managed, uh, got new management, um, right. Jazz Summers and Tony Perrin. And, um, yeah, it's all fine now. We're happy now. But now it's Made the so, album it's so funny, because when, when you look back, the statistics on I'm, I'm Too Sexy was 26 countries you were number one in. And yes. Four million albums. Yes. And, uh, and, you know, you say it's like going yes. to a, a rock and roll party and someone's going to suddenly ask you And that's you what happened. <laughs> <hand. laughs> yeah. Exactly what happened. Yeah, mate, you're not coming in here. So yeah. don't take it personally, but could you just bog off now? <laughs> but now, now your all-time favourite video. Yes. What, what, would, what would you like us to play? Um, well, the one I've chosen is Beat It. Why? Because I was working at the, at the gym when it was a big hit, when, it, when I first saw it, and I just thought it was so staggeringly good, and it's got a wicked solo in it. Yeah. And all the sounds at the front, that little sure. beatbox thing they started off with. Right. Amazing. Well, look, we're going to roll this one now, if we could, if that's all right. Of course. And, uh, when's, is this one out now, or is it just coming out, your um, song? Out on November the 20th. Okay. 
Will you be touring extensively? We will be touring extensively, yeah. These are all the noises that I really like. Oh, the really? bong noise, and then it gets into this little breakbeat thing. Oh, anyway, you like the bong? You I like, like the bong, bong noises, and bong little, noise. yeah. And the, all the, the guys and the... Well, they, they are great. fantastic, aren't yeah, they? This wicked. is one of the all-time classic yeah, videos. Yeah, wicked. And the Eddie Van Halen was cool as well. Yeah, you can hear all the edits on the solo, by the way. Sure. I must admit, it's That's very nice to see you fully dressed, because normally you're in some skimpy little outfit, aren't you? I know, I get a bit embarrassed when I see myself, you know... Well, so do we. Yeah, I know, it's sad, isn't it? I wanted to pick... Pick Nick Hayward. In fact, I mentioned it when he came off to about the nobbing thing he mentioned just oh, now. Please. I just wanted to, I asked him if I was in with a chance at all. And he made it perfectly clear that I'm not. So I should go home chagrined this evening. Well, look, we're into the vocals, so uh, look, thanks for coming in. It's a pleasure. Uh, appreciate it, Dick. Okay. Fred, thank uh, you. Uh, Richard, you can sorry. call me Dick. And, uh, all right. Thank you. Pleasure. Here we go. You don't you find it rather spooky when you watch that, uh, what Michael Jackson looked like then, and uh, on the Off The Wall album, and now you look at him and it's kind of like, woo, voice is still awesome though, but there you go. If you want to be on the, on the TV today, 0990 100 321. Rod, how are you tonight? I'm fine, Doctor. How are you? Yeah, I'm very good. Where are you? Um, I'm in Gidea Park at the moment. What video? It's um, uh, Red Hot Chili Peppers. Um, I know I asked for Under the Bridge, but I think I've got Give It Away. Give It Away. Oh, I love it. I still, with them all sort of in silver and gold, isn't it? That's right. I love it. Now, I, don't take this the wrong way. You sound, you know, not like the normal Red Hot Chili Pepper fan that I would speak to. Well, you, you could say that. I'm, I suppose I'm a little older than the average, but uh, what the hell. How old? Um, 40. Well, you sound good on it. What other kind of stuff do you like? Um, Zappa, Beef Art. <laughs> Um, Nirvana. You like a bit of a rock, don't you? Uh, I certainly do, Doctor. Yeah. Wow. Uh, by the way, uh, a comedy bank number before we forget. Um, anything between one and a hundred? Forty-five. Forty-five. Be glad to play that for you. So uh, we're going to run this now, Nursey, if we could. I hope you have a nice weekend. And uh, I mean, you turn your TV up as loud as you can and imitate the Chili Peppers with a bit of a sock on your doodah, if you I remember that one. With this and some Take care. Yeah, it's nothing personal, but sometimes I like to really punch Mr. Bean. But there you go. Um, 0990 100 321 if you want to be on. And to one of the loudest gigs I ever went to see were the Red Hot Chili Peppers when they played Brixton Academy a couple of years ago. They blew my lugs apart. Uh, probably not quite as loud as uh, Iron Maiden. Now, we've got tickets. We've got five pairs, right, Luz? Uh, here we are. These are hot tickets to see Iron Maiden at the Brixton Academy, which is uh, next Friday. So if you want to win the tickets, the question, please. What sound would you make if you were in an Iron Maiden? In, not on. I think I in. should just... In, not on. In. So for, first of all, work out what is an Iron Maiden, and then please work out what sound you would make if you were in one. And if you want to win the hot tickets, we've got five pairs now, so dial up. Let's go for it on 0990 Leslie in Islington. Hi. You can't answer the question, I'm afraid, Leslie, but there you go. All right. How are you? Fine, thanks. Good. What video for you? Coolio's and Gangster's oh, Paradise. What an exceedingly cool video and uh, record, if I may it. say. Are you uh, obviously number one? You haven't been out and bought this one, have you? No, but my niece bought it around this evening and my children are going mad for it. Really? What, what, how old are you? I'm 27. All right, so are you into this? Is this your kind of stuff yeah, or is I it for them? It's great. Oh, it's a fabulous song. Right, we're going to crank this one up here. Nursey, let's play a bit of Coolio. It is the network chart number one. We'll have to see if it is on Sunday as well. You have a nice weekend, and thanks for calling, Leslie. Thanks very here we much. go. Welcome back to the show. This is Dr. Fox. The video jukebox hotline is uh, 0990 100 321. Hope you're enjoying the show. Hope you're having a nice Friday night live across London town. Now, uh, Juicy Lucy, uh, who is actually one of our backroom staff, who's been in to sort out all the stuff for us, prizes and gigs and everything else. The question, please, before the break was... The question before the break was, what sound would you make if you were in an Iron Maiden? OK. So, Anna... Anna. Hello. Hello, Hello Anna. Hi, Foxy. Right, what noise then, please, if you were in an Iron Maiden? <laughs> right, read my lips here, Anna. Pervert. See you, have a nice weekend. Um, right, who next? Let's have a look. Who is on the telephone? Hello, is that Andy? Yep. Where are you, where are you from? Uh, Hampstead. Oh, very nice indeed. Right yeah, now, I've, know, yeah. I've got to mind my ears on this one. All right, the sound, please, if you were in an Iron Maiden. <laughs> Yeah! Hey, do that again! Oh, do I have to? Yeah, come on! Okay. Come on! 
Uh, you were too late. You missed the cue, man. Sorry. Uh, one more time. All right. One, two, three. Ah, oh, get out of it. <laughs> get out of it. OK, so uh, well, what is an Iron Maiden, please? It's, it was like in medieval times. It was a torture device. Yes, it was. And yeah. uh, Richard Fairbrass has a few in his bedroom, apparently. But <laughs> hey, you win the tickets to see Iron Maiden at Brixton Academy. I hope oh, you're ready to rock nice. and roll next Friday. Nice one. Have a good yeah. time and uh, thanks ever so much. What are the other winners, by the way, Liz? The other winners are Atha from Sutton, Carol from Labrook Grove, Grove, Jennifer from Peckham and Dave from Herne Hill. Jeff. Jeff, you're on the phone, you're on Hi. the jukebox. Hi, how I are you? I thought we had a date with Juicy Lucy. <laughs> well, yeah, 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 hang on. This is my backroom girl here, and, uh, you know, you leave her alone, okay? Bit of respect is due, yo. Uh, what video can we play? B-52's Love Shark. I would love to play this for you. Are you a huge B-52 fan? Massive, but I'm a massive How, how massive on a scale of one to a million? Sorry? On a scale of one to a million. What, B-52's or Juicy yeah. Lucy? Yeah, yeah. Either. Really? Lucy, I think a million and a half. Lie me, my giddy on. Uh, did you see the uh, Flintstones movie? And saw I the... loved it. Yeah, BC 52s, to be grammatically correct. <laughs> uh, give us a comedy bank number, by the way. Anything uh, between bank one. Number, uh, bleh, 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 Go on. 59. 69. 59. Yeah, we see, I thought you may be a 69er, personally, but a uh, 59 is yours, so we'll play the B52s. Roll it, Nursey. Have a lovely weekend and appreciate it, cool. Take care, see ya. Here we go. There are ways of breaking bad news. I went along to the hospital. I said to the doctor, How is she? How is my gene? He goes, Give me a D! <laughs> oh, it's sick and I love it. Do you notice that Harry Hill, because he always wears those big collars, looks like the man with no neck whatsoever. And you know he has a qualified doctor. I mean, what next? Can't I get a doctor doing a TV video show? But there you go. Oh, yeah, I am. Anyway, 0990 100 321. If you want to dial us up and access the video jukebox live, here we are, late in London. Um, funny. Comedy. London. We are the comedy capital of the world. So where can we go to see some gigs this week, please? Have a laugh. This week, Jenny Eclair is at Her Majesty's Theatre. There's the 10th birthday bash of the Comedy Store with the likes of Paul Merton and Josie Lawrence and all the proceeds are going to go to the Sick Children in Romania appeal. Okay. Stand Up for America at the Hackney Empire, which should be really funny. It's got Joe Brand and that also is proceeds going to the children, child victims of the AIDS epidemic in Africa. There's also the alternative Miss World contest, mm -hmm. which should be good fun. That's Friday night at the Grand Clapham Junction and that features Mark Armand and Dean. And uh, actually, we don't know whether Mark Armand will be entering into the alternative Miss World or Peter Cunner, but um, if you go along, I'm sure you'll find out. The hot ticket is definitely, by the way, Eddie Izzard, if you want to go on the Comedy State, which is the Shaftesbury Theatre, and I'm going this week, and I'm very, very excited, because it's meant to be an utter blast. Hey, Polly, how are you, Paul? Oh, thank you. Hello, how are you? What a squeaky voice you have. Are you well tonight? <laughs> I'm marvellous, thank you. And yourself? Where are you? I'm in Roehampton in London. Good old. Not in London? In London, oh, Well, yeah. you're in Roehampton in London. Absolutely. OK, what can we play? Uh, Lightning Seeds, Lucky Years, please. Did you see them a couple of weeks ago? Unfortunately not, no. Oh, they were brill. <laughs> they were brill. What are you doing this weekend? Um, not a lot. I've just been at the pub this evening and I'll probably go to the pub again tomorrow and then just to make a change, I might go on Sunday as well. Well, just to sort of vary it a bit, so you might have a bit of pub, I guess, on uh, Sunday. Possibly. Possibly, yeah. yes. Nice. OK, you're a student by any chance? Oh, we? We're a teacher. Hello to all those at Digby Church. No, you're a teacher? <laughs> Get out no, of it. I'm not a teacher. I want to be. Oh, I see. OK, my giddy up. Well, look, we're going to roll the lightning seeds oh. now, Nursey. And I uh, hope you have a lovely, lovely weekend. Thank you. Thank you so okay. much for calling up the yeah. video jukebox. OK, cheers, Bob. There we go. Roll this one. What a song. Looks natural, huh? There you go. Right. Uh, oh, the bus is coming along. Must watch out. Any look, 0990 uh, 100321 is the hotline. That is if you want to access the show live, but we are now turning that number off. We have a new number for you to dial up, which is 0891 555 955. You can dial that number now, and all during the week, we'll keep it open. So if it's busy now, just keep on dialing over the weekend and uh, through till Friday next week. Leave your favourite video, your name and telephone number, and also while you're phoning, then leave the answer to this question, because we've got some goodies. Now, Luce, give us a 12, please. What are the prizes? You see, we're getting ready for um, Halloween this week. Very spooky week. And the prizes are? We've got videos of Wolf, Mary Shelley's Frankenstein, interview with the vampire. We've got the books, the jacket, everything. And these two books as well, which are Weird Sex and Strange Deaths. 
Very nice indeed. Okay, so weird sex, strange deaths. If you want it all, the number to dial is 0891 555 955. It'll cost you no more than about 40p. It's about a minute call, I believe. So dial that anytime. Favorite video, uh, name and telephone number so we can call you back and hopefully you can win. Now, last week's question, by the way, was um, Nancy Sinatra because it was... The uh, answer was Nancy answer Sinatra. Was, uh, <laughs> hang on. Which... Which big hit song did Nancy Sinatra have? Kick your boots. There you go. These boots are made for walking. And that we had a couple of uh, boots and what have you. So the winners are, please. The winners are Paul of Greenwich, Anne from High Wycombe, Suzanne of Ballam, Colin of Gideon Park, and Samantha of Leightonstoke. 0891 555 955. Got a pack show next week, including, <clears throat> I'm sorry, China Black playing absolutely live. Looking forward to that. Thank you to uh, Nick Hayward and also to Richard Fairbrass. Have a nice weekend. We'll play out with their new song. And until then, phone up the jukebox. Have a nice weekend. Thank you, Lucy. Cheers. Bye. See you later, see you later, see you later.